<laughs> come, come, baby. Come. When did you learn this? Oh, so smart. Friday morning. And it's an early start today. I'm going to head to the clinic for early patients, then to the gym, then back to the clinic, and then home, and then back to the clinic again in the evening for more patients. It's supposed to snow today. Well, it looked like precipitation, but it was minus three. So hopefully the roads won't be too bad this afternoon when I go in in the evening. This is what Maria drew last night. Iron Man. Iron Man in Lego form. I stepped on the scale again today and 166.0 again, four days in a row. And yesterday I ran 13K and I ate great, but I don't know, seemed to be leveling off. So that goal of 139 is still far away. Trying to get back to my marathon weight. Started off at 179, down to 166.0. Stuck at that weight for a while for some reason, but it'll start going down. What are you doing? Drinking your doo doo milk? Yum yum. He's just eating by himself. It's another early morning. Who does all these early mornings? My gosh, this is my third in a row. What kind of parents are we leaving our poor baby on the floor? Oops. That means he's done. Get out of here. EIF. It's my third early shift this week in a row. It's a little painful, but it's all worth it when I get to leave early. And I have to say, it's been really, really nice on the units this week. So not complaining there. I'll all done at the clinic right now. I'm going to head to the gym, get a run in. We'll see how the run goes. Hopefully as good as yesterday, but who knows? Another great workout today. I did 13 kilometers for the second day in a row in one hour. It felt great, pretty easy. Not like the other days before when I was struggling just to do 5K, 8K, 13K. I don't know if it's um, having more energy or I'm just getting used to it, but it was a good workout. We're gonna head back to the clinic right now. I'm just leaving work. That's another week of cancer killing under my belt. This is the best part of early shift. I am going home and it's only 5.05 .05 p.m. So I'm gonna go pick up the boys from my mom and uh, we're going to go to the gym again. Tonight, Tristan gets to participate in Harry Potter night event. So I'll see how that goes and that's from 6 to 10 p.m. I need to remember to pick him up at 10 p.m. I think last time he had an event, it was Minecraft and I almost forgot to get him all done at the clinic here now i just have to go home and wait for the boys to get home from the bus tomorrow morning i pick up the new van so i think i'm getting excited again that i get new car smell coming around my way um i am very uh silly that i think that i have to finish up the tank that i have right now in this highlander um but that's just me being silly i also have to make sure i pack away the three keys that I have with the Highlander because each key will cost me $350 if I don't return it. Although the guy just said, don't forget you're to bring your two keys, but I know we have three. I will bring them all the keys back. And then it's the weekend. So exciting. How was school? Good. How about you? How was school? I saw Tristan. Where? At recess? I was hanging out with him for a little while. Look at the camera. Where did you see Tristan? Um, well, um, my class was having a little walk, and and Tristan was... He joined. You saw the older kids? Yeah. You saw the little kids? Yeah? Did you say, this is my brother? Uh, no. I, di I didn't I, say... I said, I'm like, this is my little chewy toy. Da, 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 All right, da, da. it's time to film my city update for April. I'm not gonna show all of it. I'm just gonna show the mocks that have been revealed so far in the Brick Dancer channel. Oh my gosh, my baby's walking! Best gift ever! Wow, awesome! Come, come baby, come! When did you learn this? Oh, so smart! Let, let him go, let him go! Let him go! 
Come on, come on, come on. Ha, 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 magic, baby magic. Show me how you're, show me how you walk. Okay, can I? Okay, best toy ever. Best, get out, get out, get out. Best toy ever. <laughs> Amazing toy. Amazing toy. <laughs> yeah, yay! So fun. No, no, no. Come on, little person. Ow! Little person. <laughs> Look how big my baby is now. What is a good pet alternative? Hi. Look how big my first baby is now. But I need something to cuddle with. Me. Look how big he is. Huge, huge. He's, he's now like learn how to walk. Like Hi, Hayden. Uh, so big. Uh, okay, we're going to the gym. Uh, we can go with us. Uh, Heading home from the clinic now. Last patient just Finished. I think Tristan has Harry Potter Day or Harry Potter Night at Lifetime today. Um, so I'm not sure what we're going to do when we get home. So Tristan and I are on our way to Lifetime Gym. He has his Harry Potter evening. I can't quite remember what he's going to be doing. And uh, I had to leave Mason and Hayden at my mom's. Mason because he's passed out after school and I couldn't wake him up. And Hayden only because daycare is open for babies until 7 p.m. on Fridays. So that would give me a very short workout time at the gym. Uh, Tristan will be at Lifetime until 10 p.m. So I need to remember that I have to take him and pick him back up again after that. Because I think I'm going to go home after two hours, put the other two to bed, hang out, and then go back and pick up Tristan. I just signed Tristan in for his Harry Potter event and he was a little upset with me because I did not allow him to bring his Harry Potter wand that we got from Universal's a few years ago when he saw especially other kids bringing their wands show offs like really do I want my kid to be poking somebody else's vitreous humor no I don't want to be kicked out of this gym so I said no you are not allowed to bring your wand and they're making wands today anyways out of what I don't know I don't care if they make wands out of paper at least you're not gonna be poking somebody's eye out in any case I have four hours Tristan free him Harry Pottering and I I just want to sleep in this women's lounge is that bad no I'll probably work out no I should work out so I was at the women's change room and it was pretty full for a Friday night well anyways all of my choice areas of changing and I said okay let me just sit first in the lounge read a couple of chapters of my book and then when the change room clears out, that's when I will go get changed to work out. All of a sudden, I woke up and it was like 30 minutes later and I had passed out, passed out. Does that ever happen? I blame all the early shifts I had to work this morning. I am sleepy. Anyhow, I just left. I didn't even work out, didn't bother. I'm gonna go get the other two little boys from my mom's house and take them home, feed them, have dinner. And I think Nick wants to do our segment of your full of brick. Yeah. So if you enjoyed our family vlog and you want to see more, click that like button and subscribe. Also leave a comment in the comment section. We love to hear your thoughts. And if you want to see yesterday's vlog of Tristan at the Lifetime Gym, the link is in the description below. See you guys next time.